en esta sala mismo que respaldamos. Agradecemos también. All distinguished members of the Security Council, Secretary General, Under Secretary. Before I try to deliver parts of the statement that I came here with tonight, most of it is already useless since uh, 10 p.m. New York time. I would like to cite Article 4 of the UN Charter, and it says, membership in the United Nations is open to all other peace-loving states which accept the obligations contained in the present Charter and in the judgment of the organization are able and willing to carry out these obligations. Russia is not able to carry out any of the obligations. The ambassador of the Russian Federation three minutes ago confirmed that his president declared a war on my country. So now I would like to ask the ambassador of the Russian Federation to say on the record that at this very moment, your troops do not shell and bomb Ukrainian cities. That your troops do not move in the territory of Ukraine. You have a smartphone, you can call Lavrov right now. We can make a pause to let you go out and call him. If you are not in a position to give an affirmative answer, the Russian Federation ought to relinquish responsibilities of the President of the Security Council, pass these responsibilities on to a legitimate member of the Security Council, a member that is respectful of the Charter, and I ask the members of the Security Council to convene an emergency meeting immediately and consider all necessary draft decisions to stop the war. Because it's too late, my dear colleagues, to speak about de-escalation. Too late. The Russian president declared the war on the record. Should I play the video of your president? Ambassador, shall I do that right now? Or you can't confirm it. Do not interrupt me, please. Thank you. Then don't ask me questions when you are speaking. Proceed with your Proceed with your state. Anyway, you declare the war. It is the responsibility of this body to stop the war. So I call on every one of you to do everything possible to stop the war. Or should I play the video with your president declaring the war? Thank you, Mr. President. When I spoke earlier, I said that... Well, as I said, relinquish your duties as a chair. Call Putin, call Lavrov to stop aggression. And I welcome the decision of some members of this council to meet as soon as possible to consider the necessary decision that would condemn the aggression that you launch on my people. There is no purgatory for war criminals. They go straight to hell, Ambassador. 